The other thing we need to practice in warm-ups is defensive positioning, defensive movement. So the defensive position is shoulders back, weight on your toes, air underneath your, your heels, and your hands around waist height, above your waist. So in the warm-up, you're going to practice digging with your hands, which is where the ball's coming up at your head. You're going to practice digging the ball when it's down below you. And you're also going to practice moving to get a shot from side to side. And then Jessica's going to move Mickey from side to side with some shots. Get her to move. So we got a couple underhand, now we got some overhand digs. What everybody wants to practice in warm-ups is the swing. Once again, you want to make sure that you're practicing what you want to do in a game, not a mistake. Gravity will take care of your arms swinging down. You don't need to practice that. What we need to practice in our warm-ups is going through the entire motion. Getting the, both hands up above our, our head, snapping high at the ball and leaving our hand up there. And not only do you want to practice that part of it, but you want to practice on turning the shoulders. As much as we can get our upper body torquing on the ball, the better off we are. So practice that while you're just standing on the ground. In fact, exaggerate it. Get your entire body turned around, turned crosswise, snapping up with the ball. Then not only are you going to do that, you're going to practice hitting the ball hard, but you're going to practice hitting the ball soft because in a game you're going to spike hard and you're also going to practice, you do shots. Getting used to your whole hand hitting the ball, seeing your hand hold, your whole hand hitting the ball is going to be a big part of warm-up. Really exaggerating the turn of the body, the reaching up high, seeing your hand hit, make contact with the ball. So you do a couple that are nice and hard, and then you can do some that are soft. Where you, and it, the softer ones are actually more difficult. You really have to focus on making sure your whole hand hit, gets on top of the ball. Combine all the passing, digging, and arm swing skills together into a drill called pepper. Be sure to focus intently on performing each and every technique correctly. Every time your partner is about to attack the ball, get into this position. Hands up above your waist, shoulder width apart. Knees bent, shoulders back and behind your knees. Feet balanced with your weight up on the balls of your feet. Do not be flat footed, standing upright and waiting for the ball to come to you. And every time you swing at the ball, move your feet and get directly under the ball. Do not wait for the ball to come to you or just swing out in front or to the sides. Keep your eyes on the ball. Get both hands up above your head, rotate the shoulders, fold down the off hand while snapping high at the ball with an open hand and leave your hand up high above your head. Know your target in your mind, but do not look at the target until after contact with the ball is made. 